In this video I will quickly explain how I did this cinematic tone for this night footage on CapCut on the phone. So you can see we already have pretty rich colors and this edit relies a lot on the curves and HSL to get our desired uh, tones. So let's start by opening the curves or graphs like it's called on, on the app. First we're just gonna slightly tone down the shadows because there's a lot of light in this clip. The shadows are here on the lower part of the graph. Then go on to the blue channel. And I've previously shown you a pretty super simple way to add color. This time we're gonna go just ever so slightly more advanced if you can call it that. Adding a couple of control points but only adding the blue tone onto the shadow part of the image here slightly while extracting it just a little bit from the highlights you can see the change they're only on the highlights then to balance it to make it a little less on the purple side we're gonna go do the same thing just add a little bit of green into the shadows having this kind of teal um, color tone fine tuning it adding it just a little bit more blue here's the before and after so far then we're gonna go on the temperature and make it just a little bit colder even more. The reason I didn't go fully on the temperature and I use a combination is because you can see if I drag it too much on the temperature slider I lose all the other colors and it just becomes a flat blue. So that's why I use a combination of these two. Somewhere around there is a good compromise. And then on the hue we may want to go a little bit onto the green direction. And then the final step is to open the HSL again because I like these car brake lights and just to bump up the saturation there and change it to a more uh, orange color tone. This image has a little bit of yellow on the right side as well so we could play with that. And here we see the before and after. We could we could additionally add a little bit of contrast, just basic contrast as well. There we go. Before and after. Sometimes I get these questions like, where do I find these clips? I don't find them, I go out and I record them on my iPhone. And if you want to know how I record cinematic stuff on my iPhone, check out this full video that I just posted.